Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Arts Points TV. I'm Valencia Anderson. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations passion and perseverance thank you you may now be seated today is tuesday may 10th 2022 now let's take a brain break right now though just take a moment or two take a deep breath breathing in through the nose and then breathing out through the mouth as you breathe out if you haven't done already just gently closing the eyes just feeling the weight of the body sinking down. Noticing how the body's feeling today. Respecting that, making sure you take time out if you need it. So relaxing, and offer a word of the day segment. So, Sonia, I have a project on stars coming up, and I don't know where to describe them. Can you help me out? Yeah, you can use the word luminous. What does luminous mean? When something is luminous, it is full of or gives off light. Oh, you're right. Stars are very luminous. Yep, and that's where we see them in the night sky. See, see you tomorrow, tomorrow on, on Word, word of, of the Day. day. I can just feel my vocabulary growing. Now let's go to Randy for today's sports highlights. Thank you, Valencia. Sports fans, our very own Hard Rock Stadium, just a few miles from here, hosted the first Formula One race ever to be held in Miami. There were so many megastars, musicians, and athletes, including Michael Jordan, Tom Brady, and David Beckham, who were here for the three-day affair. Max Verstappen, the current champion, had an amazing win. This was his third victory of the season so far. The next race is in Barcelona, Spain on May 22, 2022. Will this race be better than the previous? Only time will tell. Now let's go to Joshua to see what's cooking. Thank you, Randy. Today's lunch sure is yummy. It is turkey and cheese on a bun, sunch flash veggie juice, applesauce, mayo, ranch dressing, and your taste of milk. Scholars, please let your teacher know if you'll be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Valencia. Thanks, Joshua. I can't wait for lunch. Scholars, today and tomorrow, 3rd through 6th grade will be taking their math FSA. Get some rest and do your best. Good luck. The Pines Cheerleaders will be hosting our first ever student versus staff limp sync battle next Thursday, May 19th. If you would like to accept the challenge of taking on one of our staff members in this event to remember, please see Ms. Stone in room 189 or ask your teacher to reach out. You must choose a school appropriate song and bring your own props. We look forward to seeing what our Patriots can bring to the battle. Patriots, the hero store is open. Get there by 7.15 a.m. to avoid the lines. And lastly, let's check out some highlights from our FSA pep rally. If you would like to see the full video, click on the link in the description below.
teachers here. Let's see what the weather is going to be like today with y'all's dining. Thank you, Valencia. Good morning, Patriots. Today, I expect a nice and warm 86 degrees Fahrenheit with partly cloudy skies. It's a great day to enjoy outside since it's the perfect weather. In other weather news, scientists made an amazing discovery about the moon. A new study shows that the moon's soil could be used to make oxygen. 
The moon soil contains compounds that can be combined with sunlight and carbon dioxide to make oxygen, which can be used to support human life in space. Isn't it cool to think that us humans could eventually make a home in space? Now, let's check out Hot Topic with Chanel. Thank you, Yozani. Hey, Patriots. I'm Chanel, and welcome to Hot Topic. Destiny's not here right now, so I'll be your host today. Let's see what's trending this week. Hey, Star Wars fans. Disney Plus had an exciting way to kick off Star Wars Day. On May 4th, they released a trailer for Obi-Wan Kenobi. I heard Darth Vader is coming. So exciting. Hey, Patriots. Have you heard about Bitcoin's cryptocurrency? Over the weekend, it dropped by nearly 20%. Can you believe it? It's a good thing I carry cash. The Florida Panthers are bringing back ice hockey. Recently, the Panthers have kept up a streak of 5-1. to one. Hopefully, their streak lives on. Patriots are still buzzing about yesterday's Math and Science Day. Hope you had fun with your algebras and all those atoms around you. I personally take science over math any time in any galaxy. Well, that's it for this week, Patriots. Now let's go to Peyton for the birthdays. Thank you, Chanel. That's so cool. Today's birthday boy is Anthony Fisher. Happy birthday. Now let's go back to Valencia. Thanks, Peyton. Patriots here, Pot's expectations and represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Now for yesterday's trivia winners, congrats to Miss June, Miss Dawn, Miss Carter, Miss Shadid, and Miss Newton. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's trivia question, which was, what is the lowest army rank in a U.S. soldier? The correct answer is private. Teachers and scholars, here's today's trivia question. What color eyes do most humans have? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday, and don't forget, this year we are all about fundamentals and forward focus. Have a great day!